Hello and welcome to a very special Christmas edition of Saucy Boys, the only Christmas-based, source-based review show on YouTube. As far as we know. I'm Jackson Bailey. And I'm Joel Dusha, and today we're joined by our cactus. And due to a fan request, we've decided to fire the cactus and replace him with our unpaid intern, Tom. We hired him after the success of season one, mm -hmm. and he's here to join us for our first Christmas special. Uh-huh. And oh, Jackson, what sauce are we trying today? Well, we thought in the spirit of the season, in the spirit of the holidays, uh, we would uh, give condensed milk a go. <laughs> a classic festive sauce. Yes. Mm. So as you will all remember from our record-breaking, YouTube-breaking, internet-breaking season one, there is three categories. Category one, which we've added a Christmas twist to, mm -hmm. we'll be tasting what this here sauce tastes like on this here gingerbread house. Mm -hmm. Then we'll be doing the classic texture test. So that's a very simple sip test, but we take the, uh, the, the shot glass, we give it a little... Just get it up and around your mouth, see how the texture is, see, see what it tastes like on your lips and your tongue and mm. sometimes your teeth. And then finally... And finally, the third and most important category, and that is how it feels on the back of your throat. Uh, so simply with that, we take our shot glass and we cheers, as we are all good friends and we down it in one. So what are our predictions for condensed milk? Well, I feel that it's going to be sweet, which is a perfect, perfect accompaniment for the gingerbread house. Yeah, but then come the sip test and the shot, <laughs> the back of your throat test. Uh, I worry that it's gonna be too thick, but then when I squeeze it like this, <laughs> I actually find that I think it's gonna be a bit gooey and, and maybe not as thick as I think. Uh, what about any magic predictions, Jackson? So uh, obviously last season we realized that our sauce has a fourth quality that yeah, we that's often true. neglect, which is, can you do magic tricks at a child's party with it? Yeah. Uh, I think that given enough time, it'll fall out <laughs> and hit your sleeve. But if you're quick enough, you might be okay. But I'm excited to see, absolutely. Here's hoping. Uh, all right, shall we pour? I love magic. Oh, thank you so much. All right, so let's- so Jackson, uh, with the first pour. Oh thank you God. so much to our unpaid intern, Tom. <laughs> okay, so first of all, it's definitely a messy sauce. Oh, ooh, that is not white. <laughs> that is, <not laughs> is an off-white sauce. Let me give it a sniff, it's already... Yeah, give us a sniff test. Here we go. Ooh, um, ooh, some, ooh. some good sound. Oh yeah. no! <laughs> it smells like ass. <laughs> like actual ass. I'm very excited. Whoa, yeah, it comes out way far- Oh, wow, it's lumpy. <laughs> um... It has bubbles. It has... Okay. It's... And, I think it's important to note that this cannot be used as a milk substitute for children <laughs> under the age of two. But as we are all adults men. It will kill them. <laughs> you so. have had to squeeze to get it all out. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right. So, and yeah, I'd just like to point out to any government officials watching, uh, our unpaid intern Tom has agreed to do this show solely so that we sign off on his visa. Mm -hmm. um, Jackson refuses to sign as he does not want any of The moment the government gets my signature, they, they all have everything on me and I just can't live in that reality. Please to all of the uh, Saucy Boys fans out there, if you see any of mine or Jackson's details, including our full name online anywhere, please delete it and yeah. call the authorities. Just go file, delete. Control, alt, delete, that. delete. Yeah. And that'll just be doing us a favor legally. Yes, thank you so much. All right, so time for the first category. How it tastes on this here gingerbread house. So if we just... Yeah, just break this a bit of Some of that. Yeah. All right. Okay, well, so... Well, you've gone for I've... a big bit uh, unpaid <laughs> intern, Tom. <laughs> you've you uh, bit off maybe more than you can chew. <laughs> Literally and figuratively. It's surprisingly light. Yeah. yeah. I also... like this sauce, which is... <laughs> surprisingly thick. <laughs> But liquidy. It's a very weird mix. Something we haven't experienced in sauce in the past yet, which is it's both thick and weighty, yet very watery. Like it pours. Yeah. It, uh, quite a lot. It's got it's got a good drippage, yeah, we yeah, call yeah. that in the business. Alright, so let's uh, let's dive in. Let's try yep. how it tastes on this here gingerbread house. And, oh oh my yeah, God. that doesn't feel good to dip. Why is it what was that lump? Alright. <laughs> It tastes fine. Yeah, it's, there's not really much to write home about here. It tastes just like, I, look, gingerbread test, fine. Mm. But I, I now know mm. that every subsequent test is gonna <laughs> suck. I am, yeah, they have got quite a lot of sauce. You're a dripping boy. Oh yeah, it's On all your over. pants as well. Yeah, I that's noticed. good. That's all right. All right, whoop, wrong okay, thing. Wrong yep. thing, all right, we ready? Cheers, yep, yep. Chin, chin. Cheers, that was a weird cheers, cheers, cheers. Cheers. Uh, We're all nervous, all right. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. It's thick. 
Did you notice that it wouldn't come? <laughs> like yeah. no matter how hard you sucked, it's like it, it's like it was getting. But if I'd stopped, it would just flick back. Yeah, yeah, like um, flubber. Mm. It's a sauce. It's a sauce Ooh. that fights back. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It burns. Some terrible. It's a surprise burn with this sauce. Um, you swallow it, and it fills your mouth with like the texture, mm. and then it coats your throat, and it's like a comfy, comfortable coating. Until all of a sudden, it just goes from cool to very hot. Yeah, my, I feel like I need to cough up something. <laughs> yeah. Right now, you know what I Probably mean? Probably vomit. Mm. Mm. Like I... Actually, this seems like a good time to introduce. Uh, so, <clears throat> as we are source professionals, we do have a vomit bowl just in case. So, Jackson, feel free to vomit into that at any point. Just uh, tap me on the shoulder if you need it. I'll just be placing it off camera. Okay, that's cool. I will... I will point out that's quite a distance. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the throes of vomiting, but though no, that's fine. That that'll be. We're professionals. Just peachy. All right. And uh, <sighs> now for how it feels in the back of your throat. So obviously we gave our thoughts before. Any updated thoughts now that we've uh, had the first two? I think it de depending on how we. I think I may have to suck it out. Yeah. Yeah. yeah of course. Thinking. Of course. Of course. I may need to like inhale this sauce, otherwise it's just not coming. Yeah. Uh, this is definitely a sauce where we're going to have to be digging around with our tongues. Mm -hmm. Uh, which, look, it coats the tongue, which adds another flavour to mm -hmm. it. Tom, I notice yours is very lumpy somehow. <laughs> you have little chunks of something in your sauce. I, oh, I, that's gingerbread! I <laughs> gingerbread, now it's gingerbread flavoured. Okay, well that's oh, pretty that's good. Think, that's handy. I think I'm gonna go for the, the, the slightly higher pour in. You know what, maybe? Yeah, yeah. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> if we all go for a pour, a sauce like this, some sauces in the sauce world yes. have what we call drippage. I mentioned yep. it before. Uh, not every sauce has this, you're more watery sauces, they don't. But a sauce like this has truly exceptional drippage, ask any professional. And to properly show that off, I think we need to drip it into our mouths. Yeah, mm -hmm. perfect. So I'm just gonna get a little long. Yeah, yeah, it's hard being... Okay, you ready? Yeah. Here we go. Three, two, one. Uh, uh. <laughs> uh, so as predicted... <laughs> It wasn't super enjoyable. Um, again, it just keeps going and going and going. It kind of tastes like if you licked a cake that wasn't baked. Um, it's, as far as sauces go, it's quite unpleasant. I can't really imagine the uh, dense milk being my sauce of choice with any of my Christmas dishes, uh, except maybe being contained as an ingredient in something. That was <coughs> horrendous. So uh, I'm Ooh. feeling probably. I'm probably, a bit shaky. It's yeah. probably four tens out of ten for me. Um, let me hang on. Yeah, it's Chase is probably a good idea. Yeah. <coughs> um, so I don't. I kind of don't. I've heard that after childbirth. <laughs> mm, um. Women tend not to remember the pain. Yes. And I found that this sauce is sort of similar because now that I've stopped, I kind of can't remember. Yeah, it's hard to review now. That's why you gotta review it in the moment, which is what Saucy Boys is about. I would give this, I'm gonna say, because I don't remember it, maybe eight tens out of 10? Yeah, good, good, yeah. To be honest, most of my most positive experiences instantly leave my brain mm. the moment after experiencing them. <laughs> Name your best orgasm, you cannot. Uh, my belly is hot um, from that sauce. I'm going to bring it down to a six. Okay. And unpaid intern ten. Tom? I got to go for a two, two tens out of ten, because I feel that might have permanently damaged my larynx. If any of us were going to be singers, we're not now. <laughs> <laughs> and <clears throat> thank you so much for joining us for a very special Christmas edition. Uh, we'll be back with another episode shortly. Uh, and as always, I've been Joel Dusha. I've been Jackson Bailey. And this has been our unpaid intern Tom, as always. And remember, everyone, to source hard or to not source at all. <laughs> 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 Merry Christmas. <laughs> One and all. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and if you want to support our bullshit, why not become a Sanspans Plus member today? Check the show notes or head to our website, sanspansradio.com.